Hi guys, so I've been doing some painting on the um, Arcade on miniatures I bought. Um, I decided, well I couldn't really decide on what colour theme to go for. At one point I was going to do black, but then I've been painting iron hand so that's a lot of black. Um, I was going to do um, like a, a camo green colour and then I decided that was too close to the salamanders that I've done. Um, so I didn't really want to do exactly the same as the artwork on the box and things, but I did decide to go very close to it with the red. Now, if we look at the box, I have kind of tr tried to base the social miniature on that picture there. So this is what we came up with. Now, when I was in the, the Games Workshop, uh, the Carlisle Games Workshop the other the other day, um, Lewis, the manager, was trying out some of the new gem paints um, going over armour on his um, pre-heresy Blood Angels, and I thought, hmm, I'll give that a go on the um, the Kador miniatures. So this is how it's come out with. And I'm a little unsure, but I think it's come out quite nice. Just do a once round with her. So this this is my test model on the Sorcia. Now, I probably won't be using Sorcia as my warcaster, because as I said in the last video, Patrick decided to pick up the Kador box as well. So he'll be using Sorcia. I've decided to go with um, Irisk. Is it called? Is it called? Because um, I like the guy just like, standing there with the banner. I think he looks rather cool like that. So I've ordered one of them just to use as my warcaster. So, yeah, um, this is how Sorcia's turned out. I quite like the um, the shininess of the armor. It looks quite good sitting on the side and in the cabinet. So hopefully the um, the war machines. Oops, excuse me. Hopefully the war machines will look quite nice as they are. And um, if it works out, I'll um, I'll give you a quick once over of how I've actually done the armour. So there we go. That's the social miniature done. Hope you like it, and we shall catch you in the next video.